Hello and welcome to this video. It's Leonard here from datalearner.com and in today's video tutorial, I'm going to walk you step by step on how to remove or or stake your liquidity pool token, otherwise known as LPL tokens. I made a video previously on Cherry Swap, and Cherry Swap is similar to Pancake Swap or any other swapping platform that you can ever think of, and um, where you have to, you know, undergo what is called crypto yield farming. Crypto yield farming is one of the simplest way one can actually earn from the crypto space. Uh, you don't need any hustle, you don't need any KYC to do this. All you just need to do is to get that native token of that particular platform. In this case, I'm using the Cherry Swap platform. And then using the Cherry Swap platform, it means that you need to have um, the OKS wallet and use the OKT, which is the native token of the Cherry Swap platform, to be able to uh, actually farm or stake your um, crypto using this platform. So already I have a step-by-step -step video guide that shows you how to do that, how to start earning. As you can see, the CHE um, that I'm currently earning, which is the Cherry Swap um, tokens here, which I'm currently earning, I'm staking OKT and CHE to earn uh, more of the CHE. So I'm currently earning and I can just click on Harvest to harvest all of this to my wallet. And as at the time of making this video, this token is actually trading at $2.84. Uh, initially, when I made the previous video like a week ago, it was actually a dollar eighty or a dollar ninety cent. It was trading within that range, and right now it is a dollar eighty two cent. So, if you have gotten this coin, then you should be in profit right now. And if you are swapping this for any other token you, um, or uh, currency, you should get more of it. So, if you are new to my channel and you love videos about making money online and you know trading, crypto trading and investing, then this is the right channel for you. All you just need to do is hit the subscribe button. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, that way, you encourage me to make more uh, free videos like this online. So, basically, if you have not seen that video and you want to make money uh, with crypto yield farming, then you need to go to the video description to see that video. All you just need to do is first you need to get an account with OKX and then link to download uh, or to install the OKX wallet um, Chrome extension will probably be in the video description. I have a mobile version of that video on how to go about crypto yield farming and then I have a desktop version. The links will all be in the video description and basically you come in here with your OKT. First, you need to have OKT. OKT can be purchased from the OKS um, exchange. You can just use the link below to sign up an account if you don't have one already. And then once you send your OKT to your wallet, um, to your Chrome extension wallet, or if you are using the mobile version to your wallet, once you send that, it will come in here to the exchange to exchange part of the OKT to CHE. And if I come in here to the farm, let me just show you something quickly. So on the farming tab here, um, what, when it comes to the yield farming uh, aspect of it, there are you actually farming. There is a combination of always two currencies that you use. So in this case, we are using CHE. These are the two that I'm currently farming. I'm, I'm farming CHE USDT, and then the other one is um, CHE OKT. So these are all that I'm farming. So I can farm the OKT USDT or OKB USDT and the rest, but this has the highest percentage as you can see the apr here for the for, for this one is about 540 it actually started very high and it keep reducing so this one has equally reduced to 476 which is still very good compared to other swapping platform the cherry swap is still very good compared to other swapping platform so once you check the one you want to actually start earning from you come in here to the exchange you exchange that particular from the okt to the particular currency and then the next thing is to come to the liquidity tab and then on the liquidity tab you become a liquidity provider uh, what this simply means is that you are staking your coin to earn from the transaction that is carried out on this platform on a daily basis so all the fee that is paid and the rest um, all of those is what you earn from so as you can see on my farm here I'm actually earning at least a, a one or two of these um, coin daily based on the amount of money that i put in here so once you finish doing this the next thing you want to do um, is to actually unstake now what i want to let you know is that when you stake and it is a combination of your coin your okt token and the cg that you are staking whenever you say you don't want to continue again you can unstake this and the coin that have been staked here will be returned to your account 
for instance um, if I go here to the CHE USDT, you see that the CHE USDT staked is about 51 USDT. So this 51, I'm um, sorry, 51 of this two combination, the LP token, which is staked here. This 51 is a combination of the CHE and then the USDT. So if I go ahead and unstake this by using this minus button so to us take this or to remove this all i just need to do is to come in here to this minus let's say i don't want any longer i'll just click on max and then when i click on max i go ahead and confirm you see that after confirming this this will be divided into two i'll have back my cse which i initially joined to do this and then i have back my usdt which i equally initially joined to do this so all i just need to do to confirm this transaction is um, if I want to add more, I use the plus button, you can go ahead and add. And the more you have here, the more um, CHE you earn. But since I want to unstake uh, or remove it, I'll just go ahead and click on the minus. And then when I click on the minus, I'll go ahead and click on max. I want to remove everything. And I'll go ahead and click on confirm. And when I click on confirm, the OKS wallet will pop up to confirm. And you see the transaction fee or the gas fee that they're charging us is this. So I'll go ahead and click on confirm. And since I said um, OKT is the native token of this platform, as you can see, it has been um, minus already. So we'll just wait for the transaction to be confirmed. This is a confirmation. So this has been removed already. So we are no longer earning here. Everything has been removed here. And um, I was going to say that the OKT is the native token of this platform. So the OKT is what you use to pay the transaction fee for the cherry swap. So you must have some OKT in your wallet to be able to carry that in case you get an error. That is the essence of that. So you can see here the CHE, everything has been removed. So the next thing I want to do, if I check my wallet here. So if I check on the wallet here, you see that I have part of this um, CHE here and then you have the CHE LP token here. So if I want to get back my USDT, um, the USDT is showing zero here because we still have this as LP token. So for to get this back after removing it from the farm here, the next thing is to go to the liquidity tab. And here on the liquidity tab, once I click on it, you see the liquidity we have available is here. So if I just click on this arrow, this to drop it down, once I click on it to drop this down, I'm going to remove. So you can add to this or just remove. So I'll go ahead and add and, and click on remove. We want to remove this and once we click on remove it to ask us to remove either 25 50 or 75 percent but we're going to remove everything which is 100 percent so just pay attention to my wallet here right now um, i don't have any usdt right here so pay attention to this because this chelp lp token um, or lp token or liquidity pool that we this here will be divided into two so i'm going to have part of it in usdt and part of it in chg so currently i have 28 and then the usdt i have zero so if i go ahead and click on 100 percent which is max and then i'll go ahead and approve this once i approve it i'll go ahead and sign into my oks account just go ahead and click on sign in to sign in so once I sign in, the next thing now is to remove. So I'll go ahead and click on remove and I'll go ahead and confirm this transaction. So after that, click on confirm again to confirm this transaction. All right. So everything has been done. I'll just go ahead and click on close. And that is it. Now that it has been confirmed, if I go back to the wallet again, you now see that I now have some USDT. So this is the USDT that I initially converted to become a liquidity provider. And then the CHE that I had here was 28. So if you now remove 28 from this and I have everything here as um, 63. So that is this is a combination of what I had initially. So both what I earned from, you know, I was earning from this combination of these two coins and then what i initially state are what has been joined together here so i now have 63 of these and then i have back my usdt the same thing applies if you are doing for instance if the one you are farming is um the OKTCHE right here 
as you can see here the OKTCSE which I'm earning about 11 point something already so if I was take this if I want to take this job by just going here I'm clicking details and minusing this it means that this will be harvested to my wallet and then this will be divided into two so whatever combination of OKT and CG that has given me this everything will be returned back to my wallet plus the one that I have earned so this is another passive mean of earning from the crypto space and if you want to take this as I said earlier the what you've earned and what you are already staking all of them will be returned to your wallet in this case if it is okay so since I have CHE here if I want to withdraw this CHE currently the price is at $2.80 I'll just let it be here until I get maybe three dollars I get four dollars or even five dollars I can sell this if I want to swap this all I just need to do is to use the exchange platform here normally what I do is if I want to get this out I'll just come in here to the exchange and I can change my CHE to USDT or change it to OKT and when I change it to USDT or OKT I can withdraw it to my exchange and then sell it um, to whatever coin I want or sell it back directly to my bank account so if I want to exchange here I'll just come in here let's say I want to exchange my CHE I'll select CHE since I have part of this CHE and then I want to exchange it to um, USDT I can just come in here and select that if I click on max here it will tell me how much I'm going to get in USDT so 63 CHE will give me about 178 um, USDT so if I let this to get to three dollars four dollars the more of this will I get if I exchange it so I'll just go ahead and click on swap and that will swap it and I can withdraw that to my OKS exchange uh, from there I can sell it and then withdraw it up to my bank or whatever I want to do with it so basically the two coins that I can withdraw from here directly to my exchange um, is one I can withdraw it in USDT or like I withdraw it in the OKT coin to my exchange and then sell it there and you know use it to make more money i hope this video was clear enough so basically this is a step-by-step -step guide to you know on farm or to or, or stake or your lp tokens and get them back in your wallet if you like this video give it a thumbs up and i'll see you in my next video